we had a follow-up question about rituals and athletic performance. And whenever I think about rituals, I always go back to this great movie with Tom Hanks and John Candy called Splash. And basically, uh, if you saw the movie The Shape of Water, it's the movie that Shape of Water was based on, except John Candy makes a much funnier movie. Well, John Candy has this thing of picking up women that he started doing in the eighth grade. Of course, in the movie now, he's an adult. He's in his 30s, and he still does the same thing he did when he was 13. Because as he says in the movie, and it's a comedy, it worked then, it should work now. Well, that's my issue with rituals. Yes, rituals work. In fact, I'm a big believer in them. My biggest rituals, actually, is just following the checklist. So for me, uh, if I get on a plane and I see uh, the, the captain of the plane, you know, touching his forehead in a, in a, in a synchronized ritual, I have very big concerns about the flight. But if I come on a plane and I see him going through the checklist, I'm okay with it. So, but as a season progresses, we all become ritualized. Uh, it'll be a magic drink. It'll be the way, you, when I was in college, my socks I had a tube sock in one leg and I had a short sock in the other and I had the best performance of my career. So obviously for the rest of that season, I had one tall sock and one short sock because that's the way the brain works. Uh, one time when I was an athlete, I was convinced that wearing uh, sweatpants made me throw farther than wearing our athletic shorts. I believed it. It worked. The job of the coach is to come in and always question the rituals because rituals are fine until the day you can't follow your ritual. The nice thing about checklists is that checklists are always true and rituals come and go. So let's separate the two concepts. A checklist is a is a crystallized ritual, okay? And as the year, as a throwing season, as an athletic season, or any other thing you, you might, you will pick up other rituals, and that's fine in the short term. I hope I answered that question clearly enough.